There's a number of different mechanisms that you can use to add things to your SPF record. The most commonly used ones are the ones that I have listed here. So the IP4 mechanism would allow you to specify a single IP address or one of those CIDR ranges. Uh, the A mechanism uh, performs a DNS lookup for the A record for that domain, which is essentially your website. So if you're using your website uh, to send email, uh, like maybe you have a, a web form and it sends email directly from your web server and not through another service, then the A mechanism is the easiest way to include that. Uh, MX would be added if you are sending email uh, from the incoming mail servers for your domain. In your case, on Office 365, that would never be the case, so we shouldn't have to worry about that. And the include mechanism uh, allows us to include a DNS lookup for anywhere else on the internet. So, uh, for example, those uh, other sources that we were talking about, like CRM or mailing services, we would always get an include from those services uh, to add to our SPF record.